Hey, what's going on everybody? Hope you all had great holidays. Um, I was up north this weekend, so I haven't um, had time to really upload anything. Been hanging out with family and, and whatnot. Went ice fishing. Uh, for those of you that have never experienced ice fishing, I highly recommend it. Basically, it gets so cold here in Wisconsin that it was like zero degrees and uh, we were able to go out and, and uh, uh, basically dig a hole into the ice, into the lake, and then um, uh, put your line down and, and catch a fish. So didn't have a ton of luck, but I did catch one northern. I think it was about 16 inch. Uh, so my brother-in-law is actually going to pickle that and see how I've never had pickled northern before. So should be interesting. Um, I got a text that my PS5 um, was on the way yesterday and would need a signature to get it. Um, and then I got home today, it's snowing right now, and package was on the um, front step. So kind of annoyed that, you know, I was hoping that number one, that signature would be required so that nobody steals it. You know, around holidays, there's a lot of people that see boxes up on people's porches and just drive up and take them. Uh, lucky for us, our neighbor across the street has a ring doorbell, so they said, like, if, if anything happens, um, th we could always look at their footage. Um, so that, that was one good thing, but then the fact that it's snowing, like, this is all wet, so hopefully hopefully inside nothing's been damaged. But just wanted to open it up and just do an unboxing. Um, like I said, I was, was pretty happy that I was able to get this. It's, it took almost three weeks to ship, but um, GameStop had... The way that they were um, kind of fighting the bots, the people um, that were bot pre-ordering or buying all the consoles was to uh, have you go into the store and basically purchase it through in the store through the GameStop website. Um, so it requires someone to actually be there. So um, a little cold from being outside, but it doesn't seem like it's wet. So that's good. We got... Spider-Man here. I already played this, so I uh, was told that I can return it to the store. The only way I could pre-order or uh, purchase this PS5 was by ordering a bundle that came with an extra controller, a year plus, and then uh, the Spider-Man game. So yeah, the the game I'm definitely gonna um, bring back since I already have it for PS4. Maybe I'll pick up uh, maybe Assassin's Creed or something. Yeah, also hoping that uh, the PS5 will play um, Cyberpunk a little better. Yeah, this console is huge. I finally saw it in person. Best Buy had a console, uh, a demo console set up, and it's just freaking huge. So, not sure where I'll set it. Right now, I have our uh, the PS4 out in the living room here, so I'm not sure if it's going to be the same. Um, same spot it's we don't really have a ton of room on our entertainment center and the the way that the power is set up it's not really easily accessible there either so it might have to go in another room for a while but um yeah so there's a couple dents in the box so that's annoying but at least we got one it's here so yeah took took a, uh, almost a month and a half but glad to finally have this in my possession i'm not going to open it up right now uh we'll do that later on today um still got my ps4 hooked up so i'm gonna um, try some cyberpunk on that and then maybe uh, crack into this a little later so thanks for uh, tuning in we'll talk to you all soon